What's up? DJ Gons here. I want to do a quick video on how to download Serato Studio Packs. It's going to be a, kind of an update because I keep getting questions on it and I want to go through the steps again. Uh, maybe highlight some things that I probably didn't do on my other video. So here we go. So I'm going to go through all the steps because I think what's happening is where you're thinking things are at and you don't see them. So for example, I'm going to go back to the main Serato Studio page. So if you want to download a pack, log into your account, go down to products for Serato Studio, make sure you go to sounds. Here at the top, they're going to tell you what the latest ones are. You can go further down and you can download all of these. What we're going to do is download the concert hall volume two. It'll take you to this prompt here. Now I already went and downloaded it earlier. So I told it to go to my desktop. So that's what we're going to do. Close that out. So it's going to look like this right here. Some people got confused as far as like, where do I find it? It's this is the actual file or the actual folder to open it. So what we're going to do is we're going to double click on this. At the bottom, you're going to have a little progress bar telling you that it's extracting those contents. And one thing to pay attention to with it is find out what the contents are. So with this one, the contents are three demo projects and five instruments, not audio samples and not drum samples. And I think that is where the confusion is happening is you're uh, um, expecting every pack to just have audio samples or just drum samples or both of those, but some just have virtual instruments. So I'm going to close this out. So if you pay attention to the bottom, you'll see like a progress bar. It'll go up to hundred percent. And if you go to sample packs that when you talk, check the contents, it has drums. This is going to be by default. Once you download the packs, it'll make a folder there. Click all Serato packs. And these are all the packs that I have. So since I'm in my drum section, these are the drums that show up because in the jewels kit and I'll go to the jewels one, just so you can see. I'm going to go to the contents of his pack. It has eight drum kits, 24 audio samples, seven instruments, three demo projects. So the drum kits will have these here, like these full drums. When you see the symbol, that means it's the entire kit. So if I dragged it over, it replaces all of those with the that specific kit. And then these are all the individual samples of each kit. So it'll tell you why album, Jules 2, Jules 1, Jules 3. I'm going to go to audio samples. Or my bad. I'm going to go to virtual instruments. And these are the instruments that are within these sample packs. So the one that we just did was called Concert Hall Volume 2. And those are the five sounds. So when I get a loud sound right there. So these are virtual instruments. So they're supposed to represent a particular instrument. This is supposed to be an upright bass. So there you go. So hopefully that helps um, to kind of clear up some things. Um, like again, I, this is a question I keep getting um quite a bit so three main places to check is going to be drums all serato packs audio samples all serato packs instruments all serato packs and then check these here again if you have any questions hit me up on my youtube my ig at djgons123 you all take care peace